Kudo has moved way beyond the fringe. It's no longer a university project or the poor man's unity. It has established itself as a serious, lightweight game engine and the tool of choice for indie game open source enthusiasts. More people are picking up the engine every day and it's my goal to help newcomers and experienced developers alike to find places to increase their Godot skills. Here are five new tutorial channels for Godot. A game dev journey. Steve Pixelface is a new channel to YouTube making stuff with Godot. He's already making himself known amongst the community and it's great to see him starting his own channel and giving back. He already has two tutorials up, one demonstrating how to implement screen wrapping and the other how to set up a dialogue system. Great to have you as part of the Godot tutorial team, Steve. I hope to see many more videos from you in the future. Please support Steve by heading over to his channel and subscribing now. Another new Godot tutorial channel has emerged, appropriately called Godot Learning. Only a few months old, but already they have tutorials about printing variables to the screen, spawning objects, ray casting, and how to switch between multiple cameras. This channel is very promising and seems to be ideal for newcomers to the engine. So good to see channels like this popping up and I hope to showcase many more videos very soon. Let's give them some support. Please head over there and drop an encouraging word in the comments. Sloth in a Hat is another new channel which is producing content based on their experiences in the Godot engine. They're making their dream top-down survival game in Godot and they're learning plenty along the way and they've decided to share it with us. You can already learn how to make health bars, a building system and even terrain generation right now. So please show the sloth some support and let's build up this community. Raven7854 is a channel dedicated to tutorials and gameplay videos and today we'll be focused specifically on their Godot tutorials. The one which I came to his channel for went through the process of creating voxel global illumination in Godot 4. But there are a number of other Godot 4 tutorials on the channel, including Movie Maker and Light Maps. If you're keen to keep up with how to use the latest technologies in Godot 4 and be ready for the launch, then this is a good channel to follow. Full-time game developer Jacob Fox is working on his first game, Verdancy Vale. He uses the Godot engine for all of his development and he loves making tutorial vids. In his latest one he goes through the process of writing tool scripts in Godot and he talks about certain pitfalls that you may come across. If you are an experienced dev wanting to learn more about writing your own tools in Godot then this is the video for you. Visit Jacob's channel to support him and check out his other videos. That's all for this week. Thanks for joining me and I hope to see you all again next time.